Welcome again to another demonstration on how to change a toner in one of our um, printers. Today we're going to look at how to change a toner on a rubber MFC. And pretty much when your indicator panel tells you that the toner needs replacing, all we have to do simply is lift up the actual cover to expose the drum units and toner. As you can see there, we've got four units. We've got yellow, magenta, cyan, and black toward the rear there. We, for this example today, we're just going to start on the yellow. And if in doubt, any time during this process, if you look on your uh, brother printer, just to the left-hand side there, you'll see an illustration on how to do this as well. So let's make a start. So all we need to do is grab the uh, drum by the handle there and just simply pulling it straight out putting on a flat surface, preferably some paper underneath just to protect the drum underneath, but if it's a flat surface that's okay as well. This little unit is comprised of the toner and the actual drum unit itself. All we need to do to replace the toner is, this is the yellow one here, there's a green little lever to the left hand side. If we just press that, it'll lift the toner up and we actually grab it by the handle and remove that toner and the reverse, we take our toner out of our uh, box, remove all the packaging, grab it exactly the same way as we removed it, and slot it back in, and push down until it clicks. As a precaution, you may just want to just sort of lift it so it doesn't actually come, come off, and then you know it's securely attached. Grab it by the drum, that's the black handle there, walking over, making sure you line up the yellow with the yellow indicator on the right here so you get the right one in dropping it in and then closing your lid well thank you again for watching uh, how to replace a toner in a brother mfc printer